Now, the most interesting thing for everybody to understand is there are two doors to every destiny. Two doors. The front door of glory, that is fulfilling your purpose. Like what we have in the life of Joseph. Joseph eventually came through the front door of glory. Esther came through the front door of glory, a destiny. Thank God for Abraham with all the rigors, still came out through the front door of glory. The other one is the back door of shame. Now, let this be clear to you. Something happened to Samson. And by the time the man was, the man perished alongside the Philistine, they said, they don't know that God has designed it that way. The truth of the matter is that God designed the two. But you decide the one you want. So the moment that Samson passed through the back door of shame, they say it's still part of it. The truth of the matter is, the thought I have for you is of peace and not of evil. But what was the ending of Samson? Is it peace or evil? It was evil. So it was not the original. It was not the original. Adam and Eve did not know that there is a door somewhere. They did fulfill the front door. But life still continued. God was still attending to them. But not the original that God designed. Let me ask you a question. Imagine Joseph slept with Potiphar's wife. Do you think he's going to pass through this door? God forbid. Don't misinterpret grace. God is not... Author of confusion. It is what you sow that you will reap. He said, everyone will eat the fruit of his doing. Proverbs chapter 1 and verse, 20, verse 30 to 31. Everybody will eat the fruit of his choice. He said, I have said before you life and death. He created the two. Choose life. So you have the power over this. If you allow yourself to take the forbidden fruit to your door, to your destiny. Every destiny has forbidden fruit. Every destiny has do's and don'ts that support them. Samson's destiny has don'ts. Don't touch your hair. But he failed. He entered into the don'ts of his destiny and he passed through the back door of shame. The two were written before you. You have the choice. Either to go by, the for, by eating the forbidden fruit and come back, come through the back door of shame. The Bible says, not everyone that runs in a race takes the crown, but those who run according to the rule. May the Lord help you to get it right in your destiny fulfillment. God bless you.